Plain Old Ben is a fellow YouTube aviator. While I'm based at Biggin Hill, he flies from Blackpool. We get on well, but we're quite competitive. You know I'm the better pilot out of the two of us, don't you? I don't think so. Well, what makes you say that? Well, there's that time you selected the wrong runway on downwind at Shoreham, wasn't there? Go oh, India Zulu, downwind, circuit height, uh, zero 07 left hand. Uh, India Zulu, you're, you're actually you're downwind for 2-5 uh, in your present position. Oh. Yeah, I did do that. Um, but then you were lined up on final for the wrong runway at uh, Slape, was it? Well, Sierra Tango, are you uh, final for 2-3? I am actually, I just set up for a left base, go through a tank, sorry about that. Ah, uh, no worries. Oh, f*** that old, don't I? I've got um, a restricted instrument rating. So have I. I've got a night rating. So have I. I've flown a glider. I've flown a chipmunk. Yeah. We have similar flying experience, so who is the better pilot? We need a challenge. A challenge, a good challenge, what could we do? Oh, what about that? It's a helicopter. Yeah, well... I can fly that. Right, well, let's give it a go. How hard can it be? Well, cool. all good then? Yeah, yeah. all good. Ben went first while I watched closely from a safe distance. We're under the instruction of Paul from the Heli Centre at Manchester Barton. Here we go. So I'm just gently raising the collective. A little bit of left pedal. Very strange. <laughs> I think Ben is actually taking this quite seriously. I think he actually thinks he's going to be better than me. Now I've got no idea. I mean, he's a very, very good fixed wing pilot, of course, but can he fly a helicopter? Ben copes really well with the rudders and the collective controls independently. Then he's given the cyclic, the hardest to master. Uh, so I'll do the pedals in the collective. Okay. You have control of the cyclic. I control the cyclic. <laughs> That's really small inputs. Oh, he's concentrating. Look at his face. So. Very nice. Yeah, pretty good. In fairness, using all three controls individually, Ben actually manages to keep the helicopter under pretty good control. But how will he cope being in charge of all three at the same time? Ready to try all three? Uh, yeah. Cool. <laughs> all right, so uh, hands and feet on all the controls, very good. Hey, you are control, control of everything. That's it. Nice and relaxed, nice and smooth. Try and low, bring this lower, just a tiny bit lower. That's very nice. Brilliant. Ben does marvellously. See how his full lesson went over on his channel. Deep down, I'm a little worried now. He's smiling. He's smiling. He's enjoying it. He thinks he thinks he's cracked it. He thinks he's done better than me. You know? Ben was unflappable. That was a solid and assured performance. Not that Ben is modest about it, of course. How was that? Very well, I think, John. Um, as you can see, after the whole flight, um, <laughs> and Paul was backing me at times, but yeah, I think it went really well. You think you've won? Um, I definitely think I've won. But the question is, is Ben now converted from fixed wing to rotary? I've got an addictive personality, so I kind of like the idea of flying helicopters now. I probably will be back again. Not really? Not, yeah, yeah, not to me. We must thank Manchester Barton Aerodrome for allowing us to film here today and a special mention too for the Heli Centre for letting us loose with their Robinson R44. The battle of the pilots continues and it's my turn. Ben can't wait to see how I will cope. Look at that smug look on his face. Like Ben, I managed the rudder and collective controls fairly instinctively. Uh, you have control of the pedals now. Control right, just pedals. have a go at just doing some gentle left and right inputs. Okay, left we go. Is that a nervous look on Ben's face? So this time, um, you put your feet on the pedals again yep. and on the collective, and I'll give you the pedals and the collective. Pedals and collective. And then just have a go, just gentle, gentle up and down, so with pedal to balance. Okay. <laughs> But then it was time for the dreaded cyclic. 
This is where it all goes wrong, folks. <laughs> so this is the cyclic. Uh, just, just the cyclic, yeah. yeah. Just the cyclic. So oh, I'll do the panels of the collective. Does this, you have control of the cyclic? Oh my god. Oh. Oh my. <laughs> so what do I do to stop this? <laughs> oh my god. No, 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 take control, take control. Oh, uh, what did I do there? So you, you, were, yeah, you were smooth with your inputs. Um, but I guess you probably could have been a bit quicker in correcting to, them. To get to catch it. So let's say we started to move forward. It's just a very gentle back in front of the cyclone to stop that forward motion. But then we need to kind of re-centralise it again. Otherwise we'll just start to go backwards. Pep talk over, it's time for another try. And at first it looks like I might have finally got the hang of it. So you have control of the cycle. I have control of the cycle. So about right. Once uh, you relax, a little bit forward with the cycle. Yeah, just here. I think. Yeah. And there is a bit of lag. So when you make the input. Oh. No, we're going out. <laughs> I have control. So that's what we call a pilot-induced oscillation. Yeah. I've heard so, about that. Yeah, so you, you know, you go all we're going forward, then you go back and forward, and you're just over controlling. Uh, that wasn't too bad though. Go, go, with, uh, go with all three. <laughs> Are you ready? <laughs> so, uh, so, oh god. So, collective as well? Right. So, Keith says, oh, nice and relaxed, a really light grip on the cyclic, so lighter than that. Yeah. yeah. Nice and relaxed. Like, very small, light inputs. You have control? I have control. This is all you, I'm not doing anything. Nice and light. That's it. I need a bit of oops, a bit yeah. of up. Yeah, just a little bit of up though, so you can just gently raise the collective lever a little bit. That's it. Nice and gentle. There we go. Just try and hover forward. <laughs> I have control. You have control. Are we blue into the circuit? <laughs> Maybe with a bit more practice I could get the hang of this. But what does Ben think? I think that he's doing, uh, he's doing very well. Next, Paul wanted to see if I could land the helicopter. The landing, from the hover, it's just lower the collective lever, like a millimetre really. The helicopter will start to descend, but it will start to sink on what we call like, well, it sits on the ground cushion, so the air gets built up underneath the aircraft. And then you may need to just lower it another like half a millimetre just to get the aircraft sinking through that ground cushion. And then once the skids are contact with the ground, it will have a left skid low, so your left skid will touch first. And then um, once the left skid is in contact, just gently keep lowering that collective lever gently. At that point it's important, don't make any big inputs. Just keep it coming down very gently. And then when both skids are on the ground, you can fully lower the collective. Any questions? Great, so that's our little bit of Right, so hands and feet on the controls. Okay. So you have control. I have control. So it's just very gentle. No, no mate. No. Whoa. <laughs> oh, sorry. That's all right. You poor man. <laughs> you, you poor man that I'm putting you through this. I have control. You have control. So I'll tell you what we'll do. We'll do. It. I'll give you just the collective then. So yeah. I'll, I'll do the cyclic okay. and the pedals. So just your left hand on the collective. Left hand on the collective. Yeah. So looking at the front, you gently lower that collective, maybe a millimetre. That's enough. You see, we start to come down, don't we? Keep it coming down. There's that ground cushion we're sitting on, so lower it a tiny bit more. That's it, keep it coming down. There we go, keep it coming down. Kind of both skids at the same time there. Keep it all the way down now. There we go, cool. Very good. Um, there we go, have a go at takeoff. Come on then. So takeoff then, we do in what we call a two stage process. Yeah. So you're going to be looking out the front, we're going to begin to gently raise the collective lever with a little bit of left pedal and balance. And then we're going to wait till the aircraft comes light on the skids. And you're going to, you know, you'll feel the aircraft, the aircraft just you want to sort of get off the ground a little bit. And then unless we've got this cycling in exactly the right position, the chances are the aircraft isn't going to want to come straight up. It's going to want to come up, maybe nose forward or slightly left up, you know. So we'll see what the aircraft wants to do, and then we'll make an appropriate input with the cycling. Brilliant. So we're looking out the front. So you've got all the controls. I've got all the controls. We're looking out the front. Nice light grip. And then if you want to just begin to gently raise the collective lever. A little bit of left pedal, as you do. That's a good speed. There we are. Now see what's it's tipping off. to the left and nosing to the right. Oops. That's right. Oh. <laughs> 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 
I think I know who's won this competition. <laughs> and the fact they're coming back, they are coming back over. Ben knows he's won and it looks like he can't wait to rub it in. Oh dear me. I've completely blown it, haven't I? Oh, look, he's running, look, he's so uh, excited. Oh, okay. He's so excited that he's won. <laughs> My flying, if that's what you can call it, has attracted attention from one of the airport's air traffic controllers. How is he doing? Quite scary, to be honest. Really? I have to say yours was better than this. Thank you very much. No problem. Well, yeah, that's Continue. Continue. Come on, Stephen. We're getting over. Yeah. <laughs> this is cruel. Oh, cool. Currently still waiting for the aircraft to cool down. I think he actually thought I was going to do better than him. And that is the look of relief on his face. <laughs> it's the look I, thi of, look I think of he's glee. already decided, hasn't he? It's the look of glee. Yeah, it's the look of glee, because I don't think he'd be a very good loser. <laughs> I now know that trying to compete with Ben's flying skills was a mistake. How was that? Well, I think you saw what that was like then. I, I think you did really well. It was pants. I think it was pants. What, what was so pants about it, John? It's this thing here, it's not like a yoke, is it? I'm actually relieved you brought Paul and Wayne back in one piece, you know, two <laughs> friends of mine. Um, you know, that's my honest thing. Uh, well, I think I'd better stick to fixed wing flying. Despite my poor show, I've had a great day. Ben and I are good friends, really. We've bonded through the medium of YouTube and offer each other support and advice. So there you go, Ben. He may have won the challenge this time, but what will be our next adventure together?